I'm back. Do you know what we're going to do today? You're guessing it's drawing again, right? Well, guess what? We're not drawing today. We're doing something much more different. It's still art, but it's different. First, move your drawing board away. Actually, no, you still need your drawing board. Get your piece of paper. This time, get some scissors. Cut the paper into a square. It's okay if it's not exactly a square, but it's a really good thing if it is a square. And if you have any origami paper, that's good too. First, you cut it into a square. Next, I actually just figured out that we don't need a square at all. It needs to be a normal piece of paper. So you can just cut it again into a rectangle. We're making a mini one today. First, which is to say that we don't want and get your drawing board or the table and put it flat on the ground. Well, drawing board and table. It's just like this. If you can't see, I'll show you right now. Couple of me. We need you to see what I'm doing so you can follow along. This is actually very easy. We're just making a paper airplane, but it's in advanced. First, you fold it in half the long way. Then you get this flap and fold it in, just like a normal paper airplane. And then put it back, like that, right on the line. Turn it over, and then fold the flaps again. This one on top and the other side like this and fold it. And then add the one like this and flip it and add it again. And play when you're done. You can decorate it too. But I like to leave my mark plain. And then fly away. Have fun with your airplanes. Bye!